Hello there, hope you're all well. Um, hopefully, hopefully you've had a good Christmas over the last few days. Uh, I think it's the 29th of December, something like that. Um, do you know that period between Christmas and New Year when you've got holidays and you don't really know what day it is and you don't really know what you're doing or where you are? Um, but I'm out in the woods, uh, gonna come out for an overnighter um, and cook up some dinner, etc. as well. Main reason is the actual uh, finishing off the actual picnic table. Uh, so just doing a wee bit of building, uh, a wee bit of practice on woodwork, etc. Uh, so join me. Um, as I said, I'm not going to be talking a huge amount in this one. I've had man flu, um, so I've survived it and also the Christmas night out. Uh, so I said, I'll hopefully get a bit of uh, fresh air back into the lungs and uh, enjoy myself. But even just with the walk here, you can actually just feel the difference just with all that fresh air, etc. Um, so going to be quite a lot of woodwork and everything. So I'm going to be a wee bit sort of more intricate, uh, a little bit more closer videoing of the actual work that I'm doing. And uh, we'll take it from there. Uh, so just going to go up to the main camp and actually just drop everything off and then just come back down and get uh, set up for a day's work. Okay. One of the things I've been wanting to do for a wee while is sort of show you around the camp as well. Um, I think I did briefly in one of the videos, but I'm just going to quickly show you. It's really, really cool. Uh, but I just want to give a massive shout out just now to uh, Joe Robinett. Um, now, Joe Robinett's over in Canada. Um, so he does all this sort of stuff and he's inspired me to do the majority of the stuff that I've actually done um, But he's actually hit a million subscribers a million considering the genre that we, we actually cover It's a bit, a bit sort of specialist and everything as well to hit a million is absolutely fantastic uh, But go and hook him up if you haven't already done that um, some of the videos that he puts up are just absolutely amazing uh, The other guys as well are TA Outdoors. I don't know if you've uh, ever seen them as well If not go and check them out uh, father and son, the son runs the TA Outdoors, the father runs the TA Fishing, both of them absolute belters, really, really good, a uh, bit of a double act, um, real good laugh, real good laugh, you'll enjoy it. Um, but I just want to say a massive thank you uh, from my point of view as well to the subscribers. Uh, I'm up to 55, so really going well. Um, happy enough. It's actually going over a thousand views as well for all the all the videos. So really, really pleased how it's going. And I said it's just a bit of fun. You know, it's a little bit of fun coming out and actually spending a bit of time in the woods, um, seeing what's out here. And you know, the shelters themselves they don't have to be massive. They can be very simplistic. Um, I was in a position where it was a case of I had a bigger shelter and I was like, I don't need the bigger shelter, I just need it for, for me. Uh, so I've made it a lot, lot smaller. Uh, so I'm going to show you some of the actual things on it just now, uh, just so you can actually see it in a bit more detail. So to start off with, I've got a wee sort of table there, which is basically just the wedge of an actual tree and then just the actual another wedge on top. So I've just used that as a little bit of a table for things. And on it, I'm delighted with this, a little tinder bag. Uh, which is actually just the um, back seat of a car um, and I just actually cut out the actual leather itself and then actually just punch some holes in it, bit of cordage uh, so I've got my tinder in there ready for the fire tonight uh, so I'm doing a wee bit of an overnighter uh, I've then got my table I've then got my seat just there and then table and underneath there I've got the sort of wood storage and I've got a brilliant fire pit, really really pleased with the fire pit and then sort of fire deflector. And then I've got my hook just there, which has got the, the wee um, parrot hook just there, basically just for hanging billy cans, etc. And in the back, I've got the bed. So I've got wood underneath the bed, just sort of drying out, just for every time I come for the fire. And then I've got the table just there. And oh, look at that. How cool is that? Then whenever you're coming away to camp and everything as well, one of the most important things is always have it nice and prominent. First aid kit. So that's it, this will be a wee bit of fun. Um, but what I'm going to do now, that'll probably be me talking for a wee while, going to go down to the actual uh, lower part uh, and actually get cracking. So today the plan of attack is to uh, build the uh, picnic table itself and finish it all off. Okay, so I'll see you in a wee bit. Cheers.
<clears throat> it's that time when you've found all the wood that you need and you're having to make your way back to camp oh. and you're sitting there thinking the logical thing to do would be three or four trips but you're like hey what the hell I'll manage it and I want to work off some of the some of the sweets I've eaten over Christmas Where's all the snow? Have you guys got snow? Nobody seems to have snow. Apart from Joe rubbing it. I'm sure it'll come come January. Uh, looking forward to it. Got Polish Lavoo for my Christmas. 
So we're uh, gonna head out camping. Basically just means I'm not restricted to the camp anymore. I can just go wherever I fancy and uh, have some fun. And just ordering a wood, wood burning stove as well. So looking forward to that arriving. And again, that means I can sort of go out and overnighters in the actual, in the snow. Anyway, I'll see you in a wee bit. So there's the progress so far. So it seems to have worked out okay. Reasonably level. Uh, so what I just need to do is just go and get myself quite a few of these. Just sort of four on each side probably. Um, and then same on the other side and then actually get quite a lot. That's going to be the biggest amount of work. Actually getting quite a lot for the actual table section itself. So we'll crack on. It's that time of night where it's starting to get a wee bit in the dark side. I think you can probably still see okay, but it is starting to get a wee bit in the dark side. So 
I'm just going to get myself prepped for tonight more than anything else. So getting a bit of firewood going. Oh, so this is just so wet. So wet, but we'll give it a try.
So that's been a really good day so far. Uh, got a lot of build. I've only got about probably about a couple of hours actually work tomorrow uh, just to sort of finish it off. Uh, then I'll give you the full guided tour. But pleased with it so far. Uh, but just having a wee uh, spot of dinner, a couple of burgers, looking forward to it. Uh, got some lovely rolls there and a bit of cheese. So I'm going to chill out. Oh, oh, nearly forgot. Got the beers, got the beers as well. So just going to sit here, have dinner. Uh, and then I'll probably just see you in the morning. Um, and uh, it'll be a, a fun night. It's actually really, really warm. It's about 7, 8 degrees. Um, there is rain forecast later on, but I said the tarp's 100% waterproof, so it'll be fine. Okay, see you in the morning. Couldn't resist. Just look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. <coughs> and a dead pony. Harsh. Uh, just to wash it down. No, no. Morning guys, um, that was a uh, okay sleep, um, but I'm just going to get up, crack it on and get going. So a lot of what I'm going to be doing this morning is sort of wood collecting and everything as well, so I'm not going to video a lot of that, uh, but it's more a case of once I actually get the table up. I've decided I've got to earn my breakfast this morning, uh, so I'm going to try and get the actual top of the table done uh, prior to me actually doing anything else. Um, so I'll catch up with you, get some breakfast going and uh, have a bit of fun for the rest of the day. See you in a bit. Only tip uh, I always do when I'm going out to actually cut the wood and everything as well is I actually have a pre-cut length uh, so basically then I just go out with the actual pre-cut length and cut as many pieces as I actually need uh, but it saves me having to take all the wood back here or bigger bits of wood back to actually try and have to cut them um, so just a wee tip uh, the other thing as well is like I've got the camp up the top there so it's basically I mean I've been up there for most of the time uh, but when I'm working I'm down here, so when I've got the first aid kit up there, when I come down here, just make sure you take your first aid kit to wherever you're actually working, uh, just in case you need it. Okay, so nearly there, nearly there, just a few more bits of wood I think to actually go. <coughs> and then I'm going to have a picnic on the picnic table, uh, so I'm looking forward to it. So, so there's the <coughs> final thing, so I'm quite pleased with it. The um, only thing I'm going to do is, just on there, I'm going to tie the actual seat part of it actually down. But it's secure enough, it's tied to the actual tree reasonably loosely. Because um, again, from that point of view, if the tree's growing, I'm not wanting to hinder it at all. But it's quite, quite cool. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go up to camp, pack it up a little bit, and then um, I'm actually going to have my breakfast down here. Um, so I'm actually going to go and get my wee, wee stove uh, and actually christen the table. Okay, see you in a bit.
<clears throat> Time for coffee. Let's see if the eggs have survived. The bacon. The eggs have survived. Oh, yeah. Stay. I'm going to send out the real life hack with a coffee. So bacon and eggs for breakfast, can't get any better. So um, thanks a lot for coming along and uh, watching. Hopefully you've stayed till the end. If you haven't, um, shame on you. Um, but no, I know that was a little bit of a long one. So it was uh, quite enjoyable from my point of view. Something I've been wanting to do for a wee while. Only thing I've got a problem with now is what to build next. Um, <clears throat> just got a real craving for building all the time. As you can probably see around me. Um, but it's a case of the only thing I'm sort of thinking the getting from here to the top can can sometimes be a little bit treacherous uh, So I'm actually planning on building a wee bridge um, So that'll be quite good fun as well. So hopefully get get that going reasonably soon um, But no, hopefully you've enjoyed the video if you've enjoyed the video, please please subscribe uh, and hit the like button um, I said I'll turn it off just now this one getting everything cooked and uh, once everything's up and running I'll let you have a wee look just to make you feel jealous. Uh, we fry up in the morning nothing quite better uh, but no, tables worked out really, really well. Um, one of the scouts I'm, uh, I helped with was talking about putting a bit of paracord across the actual top just so I can sort of hang things off. Uh, so I'll probably do that as well. Um, but lots of branches there. I've got my keys hanging there. Cooks are hanging there and everything as well. So it's quite good. Uh, but no, hopefully you've enjoyed it. And as I said, hopefully everyone has an amazing new year um, and uh, all exciting things for next year. Uh, quite a lot of exciting things myself. I sort of mentioned yesterday about Polish Lavoo, uh, so really looking forward to that. Look forward to getting out in the kayak and sort of disappearing off places with the Lavoo and uh, staying on islands and, and just exploring. Uh, there's so much um, in Scotland to be able to sort of explore, so <coughs> hopefully I'll be able to bring you along and have a bit of fun and uh, we'll take it from there. Okay, so I'll see you in a wee bit once I've got everything all cooked up. This is a view from the actual table as well, so you can just sit there and watch the wildlife go by. <coughs> Absolutely brilliant. Wow, look at that. Okay guys, as I'm going to sit here and have my breakfast and everything as well, I'm going to call it a close. Um, but I say thank you very much for watching, hopefully you've enjoyed it. Uh, I said if you have there's going to be lots more videos like this. I said I just need to build things So please 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 if anyone can put on the um, Comments below just suggestions on what to build um, out at camp I said there's a little type of chair that I'm planning on doing and then I said I'm planning on doing the um, The bridge over to the to the other bit uh, which will make life getting back and forward a little bit easier uh, But apart from that any suggestions more than welcome uh, as I said, hopefully you've enjoyed it. I am going to thoroughly enjoy this and a wee bit of coffee in the cook, sir. Can't get better. And as I said, everyone have a good new year. Okay, remember, adventure is out there, so get out there and enjoy the woods. Cheers for now, bye-bye.